We are just three days from Super Bowl 55. A couple of Philadelphia area natives will be in the stands and they're getting a break from fighting on the front lines of the pandemic to enjoy some football. Eyewitness News reporter Greg Argos spoke with them tonight. As a thank you for their incredibly hard work, the NFL is offering some 7,500 healthcare workers tickets to the Super Bowl in Tampa, Florida this year. Most of those 7,500 work on the front lines near Tampa, Florida, but we caught up with a few of them who have direct connections to Philadelphia and are huge Eagles fans. When the Eagles won the Super Bowl in 2018, Luke O'Neill's South Florida neighbors knew it. I was the only person who was screaming at their television. I went outside. I set off both of our car alarms. The Haddonfield, New Jersey native is a second year resident at the University of South Florida, where he's been on the front lines at Tampa General Hospital, helping care for patients stricken with COVID-19. It's always in the differential. You're always worried about it. Could this be from COVID? Is this from COVID? And so when he heard from the Eagles front office, he was selected to attend Super Bowl 55 in Tampa. Luke says he was honored to be a part of it. It's a once a lifetime opportunity to go to the Super Bowl. And Luke won't be the only guy representing Philly this weekend. I'm a registered nurse in Tampa General Hospital. Kevin Boyd also offered a ticket. A born and bred Philadelphian, he even worked for the Eagles as a volunteer strength and conditioning coach back in 2014. It means a lot. I mean, Everything that we've been through for pretty much the last year, uh, we didn't know what we were facing initially. And then, you know, now to have an opportunity like this, it's like, like I won the lottery. But those lottery tickets are only for those selected and vaccinated health care workers. Second ticket to bring someone? We do not. Unfortunately, that was the first question my wife had, and the answer is unfortunately no. And you, you still told her, sorry, I'm going to this no matter what. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no, no, she's, she's extremely happy for me as well. Greg Argos, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Well deserved. Excitement for the big game is mounting. The only place to see Super Bowl is on our sister station, CBS3, this Sunday night.